Hello everyone, we are today in the streets of Zurich to ask people what is the best and the worst of living in Zurich. So if you are interested, stay with us. Let's go! What is like the best and the worst of living in Zurich for you? So for me, the best is definitely quality of living. Yeah, same for me. Yeah, having um, such a nice surrounding in front of your doorstep, just walking two minutes, being by the lake, drinking a cup of coffee, enjoying beautiful views. So that's really the best about uh, living here. And, yeah, the and worst being able actually to go hiking quite quickly, right? So um, hiking, I mean, the mountains skiing. are around this, uh, uh, around the corner. So I love that actually. So we can go skiing, hiking, and it's you know, it's like 50 minutes away uh, next to your doorstep. So you that's like amazing. Yeah. yeah, it's pretty cool. <laughs> And the worst thing, worst thing I think is that you pay around. I think is it eight bucks or so for a coffee at Starbucks? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I guess that's the worst yeah, that's thing. True. <laughs> but bucks, that's yeah. it. Not really okay. something that's that's super bad. So we love yeah, it here. We love it here. Yeah. <laughs> so I, I appreciate that. I would say the tax, and uh, like it's very expensive. But yeah, there are better and worse things in Zurich. I would say. So you would say the tax is good or bad or very bad, like high, very, very high. high. Yes. Oh, okay. That's why Zurich is expensive. Ah, okay. I exactly. mean, from a German, we come from Germany and Spain. The tax is much higher than in here. Oh, really? In Switzerland. <laughs> <laughs> and, and and what is the best then? Of, uh, I would say the lifestyle. I mean, as you can see, the jacket right yeah, now I'm it's wearing nice is jacket. from a nice um, boutique. Boutique, yeah. Moira boutique, and the lifestyle in Zurich is amazing. It's wonderful to be at the lake so near and you can do so much things and you have so much um, coffees to drink coffee and eat and go out but um, it's really expensive and uh, so yes you even say it and you're from here it's expensive right yes <laughs> <laughs> not as For, an expert no it's uh, expensive yeah. yeah yes uh, i'm with the same yeah what she thinks i like the lake i like the good food the different food uh, the shops uh, the friendly people very um, friendly yeah. yeah like you yes <laughs> <laughs> not everyone or, yeah the most are the most friendly one. yes and uh, i li like also that everything is closed when you yeah. want to go to the go mo mountains. mountain you can go skiing and um, mm. yeah it's not everything is closed the worst thing is um, the expensive and that we don't have an ocean i like the ocean you like yeah. the ocean yes yeah. that uh, yeah you have and the problem. warm the warm weather <laughs> that is, sometimes yeah. i'm missing that yes in switzerland okay <laughs> i mean i'm from the north of yeah. germany so i think over very good here <laughs> If you enjoy watching this video so far, please consider giving us a like and subscribe. And let's go on and ask the next person. Well, it's, there's a lot to say, I must say. The, I start with the best, that's easier for me. Because I love Zurich, it's a small city, but it has actually everything you need. You find um, good food, you find good restaurants, you find nice clothes buying and everything you need practically in a small place. I live here a little bit like 30 minutes walking from the center and I love that I can do everything by foot or with the public transportation that's another thing I really appreciate we have a very good public transportation which uh, you don't need a car actually only if you have buy, buy some big stuff you need need a car to transport so no, that's we great don't have too. A car neither. <laughs> then we have the, the lake I love the lake it's wonderful in summer Especially when the weather's good, it's such nice to be on the lake or at the lake. It's a good mixture of people in general. You have the, the homebred Swiss people here, but also you have foreigners, lots of foreigners, which makes it quite interesting. If you're sitting in a restaurant or in a cafe, you hear lots of different languages. I kind of like that. I, I've lived many years in, in, in other countries and I love it being back here and having this around mm -hmm. me. A little bit of an expat feeling, let's say. Mm. And the worst thing or the bad things about Zurich let me think a bit. 
what I right now what's happening is that in especially on the main roads in Switzerland, the, the Bahnhofstraße, there is like a selling out of the of the places to rent. It's not affordable anymore for small shops to rent a place. It's only the big brands that can. Might it be H&M or Gucci or Prada or whatever. And that gives a little bit a loss of diversity, which I loved about Zurich. That's going going loose now, just now happening. Um, in winter, I must say, Zurich can be quite grayish for days. It can be happen that you have no sun for several days in, in a row that may be depressing but on the <laughs> other hand the summer is very nice so what else could I say what's what's what I don't like I think maybe it's very expensive if you go to a restaurant you you eat something nice it costs a fortune also clothes cost a fortune that's maybe a bad thing I would say that the worst is uh, that it's expensive it's really expensive, especially here in Zurich. <laughs> yeah. So for me, I think one of the also worst <laughs> is maybe, I don't know, people are a little bit cold. A little bit cold, yeah? Yes, a little bit. I mean, I come from Bolivia. She comes from Peru too. Yeah. So I think comparing, of course, South American and Swiss culture, they're a little bit colder. Um, but yeah, now going to the best, I don't know. Uh, coming from Lausanne, here you have much places to go at night. Mm -hmm. So the nightlife is much better. Um, yeah, I think the stores, oh, much more yeah, stores to go shopping. <laughs> yeah. Um, oh yeah, you have the mountains so close, so you have the city and the nature just next. So yeah, I think those are the worst and best for us. Yeah. <laughs> I also have the be uh, best, like, I would say that it's very international. Yes, that's so true. So that's, that's really true. nice. Yeah. And compare like with Lausanne maybe? Yeah, and Here's, Gila, like, much it's more really, international yeah, it's here. really international, yeah. yeah. yeah I agree. Yeah. Worst thing is capitalism. Best. The lake and the river. The best is especially my place because I live here and then you can just go for a run through the water, enjoy the sun, enjoy the city. The worst is that I'm leaving. I mean, not leaving yet, but the worst is that I'm not staying forever. But there is no worst thing of living in Zurich. It's the best. I think the best is it's super lively and like I came into it expecting it to be more of a like older laid back city but I've been having like the time of my life here. <laughs> it's so much fun. I think the downside though is um, it definitely is very expensive. Like I find where I live just my apartment and like anywhere it can get quite pricey and also like everyone speaks different languages here which is great and I love it but also sometimes I have trouble like communicating with people especially like with work and stuff like that uh -huh. but besides that I think it's a beautiful city and I definitely love it so much. I like Zurich because um, we have a lake and uh, yeah it's multi um, culture many people and it's a very nice city yeah so I uh, can't say anything bad about Zurich <laughs> I think it's very clean also and um, for children also very uh, safe yeah, nothing bad to say about <laughs> honestly, yeah. I think the best is for sure that the transport, I think it's so easy to get anywhere and also of course it's absolutely gorgeous in Zurich and I think there's so many stuff to do here and that's why I love living in Switzerland and also in Zurich. And I don't know about the worst, I don't really think there are that many like bad reasons to live here. I don't know, can you come up with any bad things? Maybe like a lot of people. So. Mm, yeah, sometimes there can be a lot of people, so maybe when there are a lot of tourists, I don't really like that when there are a lot of tourists, yeah. it can be kind of bad, but other than that, I really like living in Zurich, and it's really clean, yeah. which oh. is nice. What is the best and the worst of living in Zurich? So maybe you can give us an answer. Okay, so I live in Zurich, so I live on, 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 the, on the hill of Zurich, on the Zurich uh -huh. Zurichberg, nice and, location. And so yeah. so it, it is very comfortable to live here and uh, today I walked with my wife down here uh -huh. so and uh, it, it is uh, quite comfortable to walk and you, you are in the wood, you have good, good paths and, and so 
Yeah, that, that's, that, that's the reason for living yeah. here. So. <laughs> Especially when we have such a great day like today, yeah. right? Okay, so the weather, of course, is always a point. If it's raining, we do not walk. Okay. okay. But all the churches we have already seen. But of course, it's nice to have the big cathedral, the smaller churches and everything. Yeah. So. <laughs> so and, and can you say like anything which you don't like so much also? Or is there nothing you have or the traffic and the, the traffic and the 30 kilometers an hour zones ah 30 kilometers an hour zone in the traffic <laughs> okay yeah, yeah i understand that, that. that's a problem so you're you like know? yeah i understand <laughs> so for me the best is to visit my brother here because he is living here and i really love the city and the water and the streets just uh, struggling around and enjoy life enjoy life yeah and what is something you don't like there's nothing i don't like Probably the prices. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> no, everything is fine here. Oh, okay. But my heart is quite open when I'm here. <laughs> Thank you very much for watching. If you enjoyed this video, please consider giving us a like and subscribe. And what is the next question that you think we should ask within the streets of Zurich? Let us know down below in the comments and see you next week. See you.